What's going on everybody? This is Captain Obvious, or Cap for short, and welcome back to another Minecraft tutorial. Alright, so this is just a really fun project I wanted to do. You can build them more simply. I have another lava collector uh, farm if you want. I will leave a link uh, in the description. I'll also put a card right here. And you can go ahead and do that. This was just something I wanted to work on. I haven't built a fun redstone farm uh, in a long time. It's useful. But it's, you know, it's a little over the top. But uh, let me just show you what it does. Okay. The, each of these cauldrons will collect lava. As they collect, the one above it that's empty will be, shot, will be shot out, will be pushed forward. Once they're all full, you'll notice all the lights on. So then all you got to do is just come through. You harvest it. Okay. You harvest it like that. And like this. And like this. And like this. And then like this. And once you harvest the one below it, you'll notice they all retract. And it's going to be back to this one. Okay. Now you have yourself five buckets of lava. And the farm will start all over again. And the reason I wanted to do it is just from far away. Okay. You have the lights. They're indicators. So if you have it, you know, somewhere in your world where you're working on it. Where you're still within range of it. Oh, there you go. You'll notice. Okay. I got one lava bucket full. Or, you know, one cauldron full. Which is enough for one bucket. And you'll notice. Boom. This one gets shot out. It's empty. So that'll drip. Oh, there we go again. Look at that. It'll drip. It'll push the next one out. Now you got another empty one at the ready. And this is just something really, really fun I wanted to do. Okay, so let's just get into what you need and how to build it. Here is everything you're going to need. You're going to need two about two stacks of stone bricks, 12 redstone dust, five cauldrons. Uh, you're going to need a lava bucket just to put down the initial lava that we're going to harvest. Uh, th the design, you're going to need 31 red terracotta, dripstone block. You're going to need five lamps, four sticky pistons, 16 stone brick stairs, Five comparators, one pointed dripstone, eight chains, uh, two lanterns, 24 slabs, and six spruce trap doors. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to put down our stone brick, and then we're going to come up with our sticky pistons. One, two, three, four. Now we're going to come in here with our cauldrons and go one, two, three, four, five. You'll notice that bottom cauldron is always out. There's no need for it to retract. We just need to make sure that the other ones are tracked so we can actually get up to it, okay? And now what we're gonna do is we're gonna put it out here. So one forward from that, we're gonna go uh, comparator. We're gonna put, actually let's put a put a block there. Okay, put a stack of blocks right there. We're gonna go comparator to the left, block there on the right, comparator facing out, then block this way, then comparator, then block this way, then comparator, and block this way, and then comparator, and that will be uh, all the comparators you're going to need, okay? And now what we're going to do is actually, sorry, this one can go block there, and then this one can actually go right here. So that cauldron is going to actually stay out there. Now what we're going to do is we want to make sure we go one higher, so we can actually put that there, and then block, and then put a dripstone block here, and then you're going to hang your pointed dripstone under it like so. Okay, and then you're just going to just cover that up however you want. Okay, now what we're going to do is we're going to cover up the front right here. So we're just going to go just like that. Okay, just like that. You can put a block there. And then we're going to go one above it. Put a block. And then go all around just like that. And now you're going to put your lava inside okay one quick correction we're actually going to drop this down one put that here and like that okay so it's going to look like that in the front now what we're going to do is right in front of where the uh comparators are you're going to go ahead and you're going to place a light source as you can see it already dripped down we already got it then you're going to put stone brick then a lamp so all the lamps are right in front of where the comparators are okay so go on this side again you're going to go block lamp block lamp and then you just go block block like that okay we're actually going to make this too high and this another high so it'll be three high above that one and two high above that one okay now we're going to come behind and what we're going to do is we're going to take our redstone and we're going to go one two three now you'll notice that the next cauldron got pushed out this thing is probably going to be filled by the time you do it so just you know just be aware of that then we're going to come here we're going to go like that okay and we're going to go up so we're going to go one, two, three, like so. Now we're going to come here. We're going to go one, 
two, three, and then again, we're going to go up. So we're basically just going to keep stair stepping it up like that. This one's going to be a little different. This one we can put down a block. And then what you want to do is put down a slab and then another block right here. So one, two, three, just like that. Okay, now all we're going to do is we're just going to go one here and then just like so right there. And actually, you can even put another one there. Now, if you don't want all that other stuff, you're done. You're done. You were done once that last piece of redstone uh, right here was put. The farm itself is done. For everybody that wants the entire design, stick around. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go diagonal. Okay, so if we're looking at it, we're going to go diagonal back. And we're just going to go up with the red. Okay, just like so. Come in. Go up. Go all the way across, come down, go out, and then we're going to do oops, the same thing so it looks just like so. Now, coming back in diagonal, we're going to go up nine. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Same thing on this side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, just like that. Then, what we're going to do is we're going to come out here like this. We're going to take our slab. We're going to run it all the way across, just like that. We're going to take our chains. We're going to go one, and then you're going to hang this down four. So two, three, four. Drop a lantern. Same thing on this side. Okay, now what we're going to do is we're going to take our stairs. We're going to go here and here, and then on the side as well. We're going to put those there. We're going to do the same thing on the top, right? We're going to go sideways. Sideways. We're going to put one up here like this. We're then going to come in here with our slabs and we're going to go we're actually going to drop this down although this one right here actually can be a full block so we're going to put a full block right here a full block right there just like that and then we're going to take our slabs again and just put them on the top going across so it looks like that and then for the bottom here we're just going to turn it like this which is just a little decoration like that for this one, we can go same thing. We can go there, do a slab here, and then we can actually put a brick on top of that. Okay, and again, it would be right here. So if you're looking at the change, it's, it's that second chain down and put a slab here. And now all we got to do is just come in the bottom here and just fill this in with red uh, terracotta. We got to put a spruce trap door there and there so it's going to go two across and then one underneath just for a little bit of extra definition now we're done and you'll notice we already got all of them filled up okay so just to show you that it works remember you got to start from the top so you go one two three four five it starts all over again as soon as it fills up you'll notice that light activate the one above it will uh, will push out Okay, and, and you're good to go. So I'm really I'm really digging this design. Let me know what you think. Uh, I just wanted to have a lot of fun with it. Again, there are other ways you can do it where you collect a lot more. This is just an over-the-top, fun redstone build that I really wanted to build and share with you. That's going to do it for me. Until next time, Captain Obvious out. Peace.